we are the team eight and we are the people of three are uh, Mahesh Babu, Guru Charan and uh, Reddy. And we have developed the project uh, named with the uh, market student marketplace. Uh, it is developed with various technologies like ArcGIS, NodeJS, Laravel, PHP, and databases. And it aids the students in buying and selling of the goods. The student gets access to the data and he can buy the products and business owner and the admin can uh, um, uh, join the club and he can uh, delete the club and manage the club and all those things. And the remaining thing will be will be taken by my friends, my teammates, Sharon and Reddy. So uh, to use this account, to use this application, one should have the uh, account um, here. So they have to register by themselves by clicking on the register here. So all these fields are uh, validated. So so for the uh, time being, I am removing the domain here. Uh, they have they are they are also need to uh, mention here the which role under they are going to enroll here so when i am clicking here like it will show an error domain is missing so i am putting the domain here gmail and i am trying to register here you can see message has been sent successfully and you will get a mail with the activation link here so you need to activate the link before you are going to log in So I actually activate the account. And you have to click login here and you have to log in with the same credentials that you have used for registration. When I am registering, I am registered under the super admin module. So super admin has uh, ability to manage the school admins and also um, manipulate the data of the students and also can uh, able to change the business owner details and by you uh, super admin can able to add the business owners and also can able to activate the students so from now onwards my, my team entity will continue yeah hope you guys can see my screen so this is a student profile page so student has the privilege to update the profile and update his address so after clicking the update profile page, the student can update his password, Gmail, uh, mobile number, uh, etc. And going back to the profile page, the student has the privilege to add a club, join a club, delete a club and leave a club. So in order to add a club, the students needs to enter the club name. So I'm leaving like uh, club three and I can mention the contact number of the uh, owner and I can also mention the Gmail address of the owner and also I can mention a description of the club. So after clicking save club, uh, going back to the profile page, uh, you can see the club is added here and in order to delete the club, you can just click the delete button. So as you see, the club is deleted from here. So in order to join a club, you can just click join a club button. So you can see a list of clubs created by all other students. So if I want to join the developer student club, I can just click join club. So the club will be added in my profile. And in order to leave a club, you can just click leave a club button. So as you see, the like uh, the club is removed from the student profile page and student also have the privilege to post advertisement so you can just click the post advertisement button and you can just mention the advertisement name and also the description about the uh, advertisement and you can just uh, save the advertisement so going back to the profile page you can see the advertisement listed here and in order to delete the advertisement you can just click the delete button so as you see the advertisement is deleted from the student profile page and also the student can add a product so in order to add a product you just need to mention the uh, product name and uh, you can just mention the details and also you can mention the price so as you see going back to the profile page you can see the product is added here with the details so if you want to delete the product you can just click delete the product and the profile like and the product will be deleted so the rest of the details will be explained by my teammate uh, mahesh so mahesh you can continue yeah hello i'm explaining about the business owner uh the 
business owner can perform the, and manage the uh, various tasks like uh, he can uh, add the, he can uh, add the club and he can create the club and uh, he can control over the goods and orders and uh, he can chart over the uh, students uh, uh, i'll explain the chart functionality it was developed with uh, node.js uh, this is the chart functionalities and uh, he can chart with the student uh, with the uh, kurcharan and uh, uh, he can type his message uh, he, uh, he wants to tell. When he clicks on that, uh, it will show the timestamp there uh, with uh, the recipient address under the timestamp. And he, uh, he can log in with the student and he can see that message. This is the message sent by the uh, super, uh, business owner to the student. He can uh, view that message. And that message is hi. This is the chat functionality. And other thing is, uh, 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 I will show the home uh, how to how the student can buy the products. Uh, in the home page, there will be the list of the products, and uh, he, the student can buy. And when he clicks on, uh, he can enter, uh, he can increment, and when he click on the add to cart. If he wants to buy the Apple iPod and he, he clicks on the Apple card, it will go to checkout orders. And uh, he can uh, uh, select the, his payment uh, payment method and he can uh, update his address and he can select the payment method he, he wants. If he select the credit card and he, he wants to play, place an order, it will uh, go to the pay, payment uh, method all and he can fill the details and he can proceed the, uh, he can uh, give his information and he can proceed further. This is the this is our application and uh, we want to show the PPT. So uh, this is a PowerPoint presentation. Uh, that was um, uh, developed by us. So uh, the languages that are used to create this uh, web application are HTML and CSS and JavaScript, React as well. So and uh, we also use the database connections um, uh, using uh, MySQL, and uh, we also use the Laravel and um, MVC frameworks as a backend um, languages. And for the block block development, we use actually we use the WordPress. And uh, we created the uh, login page and registration space using the Laravel uh, technology. So uh, and uh, while registering, all the fields are mandatory and all the fields are uh, validated. So uh, after registering successfully, uh, we will get a uh, activation link and we need to activate that link. So when we activate the link, we will go to the uh, login login page and we need to try to Login with the same credentials uh, that are used for un for registering. And now, yeah. will now with, uh, you can you will develop the chart functionality. You can resolve his queries by chatting with us, and uh, he can mail with uh, provided uh, with, with the prescribed and provided mail. And the improvements with what we have to be developed with the chart functionality is uh, only one. And uh, we can we have to provide the attach file functionality also, where he can uh, pro where he can send the files. With, and uh, the chart encryption also must be developed in the database because we, without this we, because we, everybody can see the uh, what the message is so that the encryption should be provided uh, with this function and the references uh, we, we we have used in this class by our professor is uh, external css uh, for uh, react files and some several queries like especially media query uh, for page responsiveness and other thing is uh, serverless computing where we have developed and deployed that application in the UTA cloud and uh, chart JS integration also uh, is much useful for us uh, in developing this uh, project uh, which was teached by our professor and SQL joins and Laravel connections and PHP database connections also. 
you are talking about the different challenges faced one challenge was scheduling meeting at convenient time for all the team members so by pro proper planning we were able to overcome this to a great extent and the other uh, challenge was learning new technologies like a php laravel and implementing that to our project and also um, the third challenge was combining everyone's uh, work and uh, talking about the different improvements that can be made one improvement is like uh, adding the two factor multi authentication while logging in and also we have improved the secure protocol implementation this should be providing a greater user experience and also we could have improved the existing chat by improving the ui and also making the chat more responsive and also we could have added sql triggers react triggers which um, improve the page responses and the user experience so how to add the project in our resume so during the resume in the project uh, part we can list this uh, project and also we can add the different skills learned during this project uh, development and also we can also provide a github link of the project where the uh, recruiter can check the project and also during the interview we can also show a demo of the project which uh, show our expertise uh, in react php laravel node and uh, all other kinds of uh, technologies so that's it this comprises the demo and the ppt of our project uh, thank you thank you for giving this opportunity thank you